Osteoarthritis is the most common form of arthritis and affects millions of individuals. It is classified as mild, moderate, to severe. It affects many parts of the body, including the knee. The knee joint is made up of the femur, tibia, patella, along with the synovial membrane, which contains synovial fluid. Synovial fluid acts as a lubricant in the knee joint. The end of the femur is covered in articular cartilage, which moves against the articular cartilage of the tibia. In a healthy knee, the articular cartilage is smooth, without fissuring, and the bone is smooth. The synovial fluid is viscous, aiding in lubrication. The knee can move through its range of motion without pain. Over time, osteoarthritis affects the bone, cartilage, and synovial fluid of the knee. With mild knee osteoarthritis, you will begin to have discomfort in the knee joint. Though the joint space appears normal, the cartilage matrix has begun to break down from a combination of wear and tear and increased production of degrading enzymes. In addition, bone spurs, known as osteophytes, may begin to develop on the edge of the joint. These small, smooth, dense growths of bone are part of the body's natural response to the loss of cartilage. Progression of the disease may be slowed at this stage by increased exercise and weight loss. With moderate knee OA, changes in the joint are much more evident. The cartilage surface between the bones has begun to erode, narrowing the gap between the femur and the tibia. Hyaluronic acid, which helps synovial fluid lubricate the joint, is now becoming less viscous, elastic, and concentrated. Osteoarthritis often affects the subchondral bone, located just underneath the cartilage. Subchondral bone provides hydration and oxygen to the cartilage. As subchondral bone flattens and tries to repair itself, cytokines and proteins are released into the synovial fluid. Osteophytes may increase in number and size, making the bone rougher. All these factors combine to make joint pain more severe and long-lasting, both with movement and at rest. Weight loss and exercise, pain relievers, HA, or steroid injections are commonly prescribed treatments. With severe OA, conditions worsen dramatically. The joint space has become far narrower, causing more rapid and severe destruction of the cartilage. The knee becomes inflamed and sore. Synovial fluid is decreased, increasing friction and pain during movement. Within the synovial membrane, destructive proteins are produced which further degrade cartilage and soft tissue around the knee. Osteophytes continue to develop. Bone moves against bone, not cartilage. Mobility, activities of daily living, and quality of life are severely impacted. Treatment for severe OA is typically surgery by receiving a partial or total knee replacement. If you are suffering from knee osteoarthritis, speak to your physician to discuss treatment options.